With some of the technology that we offer at Azure, uh, both to secure networks and also to deploy very simple uh, appliances, um, Barracuda building on top of those solutions uh, enables it customers to really deploy in an agile way. Uh, they can deploy and try things out, uh, they can configure things and change those configurations uh, very quickly, uh, which enables customers to sort of try and learn as they go, which I think will result in the most secure environments. They don't feel as restricted to uh, deploy a secure environment and then hope it was right. They can actually try and test and try and test uh, and continually learn uh, as sort of the platform is growing uh, together. There's only so much that we can do from the Azure side. We're offering infrastructure, we're offering the computers, the uh, network backend, uh, but once you get into the customer space and once you get into the customer network that they're defining and they're managing, that's where Barracuda really comes in strong. Uh, it enables customers to both protect and secure from external sources and also to help protect and secure from intrusion that may happen inside their own deployments. All of this is actually above the level where Azure is even aware that this has happened. One of the most common usage cases we're seeing for customers is really sort of a lift and shift approach, uh, taking an application that's deployed on premises and just getting the agility and the cost savings that the cloud can offer. As part of that, they want to connect with sort of a high throughput connectivity. And with Azure, we offer Express Route, but you may still want to secure it. In fact, you almost certainly still want to secure it. Um, and this is where Barracuda NG Firewall will enable you to secure that, treating sort of that public and private cloud with that level of um, risk avoidance as you deploy that lift and shift solution into the public cloud. You can also then deploy a solution like Barracuda WAF solution to be able to secure that front end. Right? And so it then becomes that, uh, that firewall at the very front of the application. And with a single click, you can combine all these pieces together using the template language. And so Barracuda being there at the beginning with the template language and supporting it with, uh, with the appliances that they offer enables customers to both deploy applications and secure them all in one click. One of the interesting things about SharePoint is it has a couple of deployment options. One that's sort of geared towards collaboration, and, and of course you can deploy that in Azure, you can use the Office 365 solution. But another that's called for internet sites. And this ends up being uh, the SharePoint engine to be able to expose internet-facing sites uh, that people can build on and sort of collaborate on top of, but they're geared towards public internet exposure. And this is where a solution like WAF, sitting on top of that, uh, will enable you to both have the power of SharePoint with the agility of Azure, while coupling the security that Barracuda WAF clients will offer. It'd be very easy to take a SharePoint template, uh, deploy into that same virtual network, uh, the Barracuda WAF solution to secure that SharePoint farm um, in really just a few clicks uh, and be off to the races with your application secure and ready to roll.